surprise package in the mail today from Next Level Miniatures. Um, they have a Kickstarter that just finished. Um, should be shipping by hopefully this calendar year. Um, it was going to be this fall. Um, these are not the Kickstarter minis. These are uh, promos that they brought to Gen Con. And from what I understand, these are really small scale, like barely 28 millimeter. Okay, so I just dumped these out. Um, you were seeing them practically as soon as I did. So I was expecting these to have bases, um, but they don't. This is, um, so these are made of Sio Res. It's a thermo injected plastic. Um, they're calling it resin. So these are pretty bendable. The Reaper stuff, they've been using what they call the Sio Res Hard. So it's a little less bendy, a little stiffer, stiffer plastic. So there's a goblin. Still a little bit of sprue on it. Yeah, they're pretty bendy. That's pretty. That's good. It's it feels tough. That's some pretty good detail. It's a flat. I mean, you could tell this was made for a this was made for a metal mold. Right? This is flat without a lot of under some undercut there. Um, but this this was sculpted for a metal mold and then modified to get the details a little bit higher. So I got, you know, uh, what do I got? I got a male and a female dwarf. I got a couple goblins. Um, this is a fun dwarf. I like, I like that dwarf. Got a cultist with a little sprue, sprue sticking out of his head. Uh, so not a great job on the sprue cleanup, but that's fine. I guess that would be a vent probably, right? The, the feeder sprues on the bottom. So that's just a, that's just a vent. Um, is there detail on the book? There's a little writing on the book. That's cute. That's real neat. Like that a lot. Um, here's a little like uh, shaman wild guy. That's fun. There's a third goblin. Oh, come on, focus. There we go. He's a little thief with a little neck, neck thing on. And pedestal book this one doesn't have writing on it so they had a bunch of terrain I didn't get all the terrain it was mostly like um uh, here's a portal I like uh, been collecting portals lately I got two from Dungeons and Lasers I got a big one from Reaper um, so I've been collecting portal, por portals lately I'll put a nice swirly you know blue purple pastel on on there it'll be fun um, and this so from what I understand, you do not need to prime these. Uh, I'll probably give them a soapy wash, like the Reaper Bone stuff, clean up the flashing. Um, so that's a little preview, a little campfire, a little preview of what to expect. This one feels a little stiffer. I wonder if that's a little different plastic. Um, yeah, it feels a little stiffer than these guys. Whoop, okay, and there I broke it. So we're going to glue him back together. That shouldn't be a problem. That was a pretty thick sword. Um, so that's the next level miniatures. I'll link, uh, I'll link to their website below.